one of the biggest questions I get is how can we get more leads? Because every time that we sign somebody up for LSA, we get a badge approved. They just want to get more leads because they understand that they're getting leads at literally like sometimes like 10% of what they're normally paying with regular Google ads. So the question is, is how do you get more leads? If you're asking that question, it's a great question. And that's actually one of the reasons why we're training you on this is because if you want to have your local service ad page set up for the long haul, then there's a few things that you want to do because ultimately it just comes, it's a numbers game. You've heard that many times before. The more local service ad pages that you have, the better off that you are. The more likely it is that you're actually going to get more leads. It's just simple. The more pages you have, the more leads you're going to get. It's the more fishing poles you have in the water. Radius right now is what we want to talk about. So you want to make sure that you are covering as large of an area as you possibly can. The way to do that and what we found, and I'm going to show you some data in a little bit here, is that we found that it really matters if you actually set up not only more locations, but if you do it in a very strategic way. And the way that you want to do it is you want to set up local service ad pages in major cities right now in the beginning. Why? Because major cities have the volume of leads that you're looking for. And what you then want to do is you want to expand your service area to cover the entire state. How do you make sure that those LSA pages stay for the long haul? Google My Business standards are way higher for verification than LSA right now. LSA is the new kid on the block. And that's the reason why I wanted to bring in Crystal in order to help you guys understand what you might want to watch out for if you're trying to do this on your own. Some things that you definitely want to watch out for that a lot of um, lawyers will do is that they will get into a lease contract with a virtual office. And so virtual offices are against Google's guidelines. So what happens is when you go through the verification process, you sign in through Google My Business, you put in your business name, you put your address in because you've got a PO box address or you put in a virtual address that will accept mail. And then you immediately put that verification code once you receive it 14 business days later, you go into an automatic suspension because Google's system already recognizes a lot of these addresses that are virtual offices. And then now you've got a suspended Google My Business page and you're trying to figure out what to do next in order to set up your Google local service ads page. And you've seen this many times as a Google My Business product expert, many pages getting shut down, many Google My Business pages being shut down. So it's imperative that these pages are set up correctly for the long-term success, not only for that GMB page, but also for the LSA page, both of them. Now that you say that, we have some offices that have been um, set up, that have been in business for a very long time, 15 years or more, and they're setting up in a new location or a new state. And despite them having a brick and mortar uh, type of address or a actual walk-in from the street, they're signage is listed in the lobby and you have proof that they have an office in this building, they're still getting suspended because Google has such high standards, especially with law firms, that you need that help for uh, verification. You need experts to help you with this process. So let me just share my screen here. Okay. This is one of the attorneys that's going after smaller cities. You can see here's the number of leads they're getting from these new locations. Not, not many, but here's two attorneys that are now going after, and here's some of these new locations that are in bigger cities that have only been around. You can see two, eight, three, five. You know, they're already getting a decent volume in less than maybe three or four weeks. Here's another PI attorney, you know, seven, two, um, and their, their main location was getting 40. And th these locations were just set up. Our PI attorneys are getting cases between $300 and $500, you know, with LSA. And they're normally spending between three and almost $3,000 and $5,000 with rather regular Google ads. So anyway, um, we hope that you found this valuable. Crystal, you're awesome. Thank you. And um, we'll see you guys on the other side. All right, thanks. Thanks.